Assalamu alaikum guys, in this video we'll learn how to build a super dynamic search function that enables you to search inside the model columns or inside the relation column itself or inside the nested relation of this model. So here we have three models, I have user and this user has many skills and here our skills belongs to a field. So for example here in my database I have users, I have two users and in my skills table i have bunch of skills here for user id number one he has these skills inside these fields so here, here for example user id number one has a php skill inside the programming field here i have by the way two fields as you can see here programming and spoken languages another example to make it clear here for example user id number Two has a flutter skill inside programming field and also user id number one and two has skills english in the spoken languages field as you can see here so let's start first of all i will go to my user model so first of all i will define the searchable columns i want to use so here i want to search inside the user model itself for name and email or related skills name or related skills fields name so quickly i will say function we will create a scope called search here and i will say here builder eloquente builder i will inject it this class eloquente builder and i will say here builder after injection and as a parameter it will be a string term that i want to search about right don't forget i want to search in this field so currently let's comment these lines and if you notice here we have an array so we'll say here for each this searchable here as searchable and let's tie a number here and do, let's see what will happen here searchable we will loop around our searchable array columns and i am using this method here this our scope and the term i want to search about from the url query you can watch this lesson to learn more about requests and then i am using get and i return as json response so back here, refresh, and I will say, for example, term equal to ABC, right? I will undy 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 here term, refresh, ABC, and I will die it also inside our user model to make sure it works correctly. Term, refresh, the same result from the user model. And if you see here, it loops now around name and email then i will say builder or where method and here or where if you notice here column name which is our name here now searchable and operator like for searching and i will say between two persons search for this term inside this using builder here and then i will say return builder so what happened here i will die and dump here builder to sql it loops and concatenate with the previous builder by the way or where if it's in the first place it will use where not or where so let's see here die and dump as you can see I will zoom select or from users where name like this term or email like this term right let's remove the and dump and I am using it here search using this term refresh so I have new user with ABC but if I entered Ahmed it returns Ahmed only as you can see here in my users I have Ahmed and Muhammad Let's search by email also here. 
returns what if I make it like that returns null what if I enter Muhammad or MOH returns Muhammad because I'm using like here right here just like between two persons so what if we want to search inside scales.name here I have a relationship called scales and we can say here we can check if the searchable contains dot here it means it searches inside relationship so we can say here if str contains if this searchable represents our array values searchable contains dot let's see die and dump searchable here refresh as you can see scales dot name right now I will use here builder or where relationship and if you notice tick relation and the column inside this relation and operator and value so I will say here relation and using str helper class from illuminate support here I will say a method called before before last and I will say inside searchable before last dot and the column here column after last dot right let's simplify it and let's see here dd relation our relation here the last value before dot which is here scales dot name the last value before dot is scales which is our relationship name here right let's die and dump and let's remove it refresh return scales also return the name here name sorry or column name refresh again it is in scales dot name so I separated them using this helper class here and I will say the first parameter is our relationship name and column and the operator is like also and the same is term and don't forget to continue here because it contains dot which means search inside this relationship right refresh it returns Muhammad because I am searching in user's name or email or scales dot name so it's back and see here scales and this search for AI for example here AI and if you notice here it returns AI because this user email has AI word and here also the same and also the skill name is here AI right what if we search for PHP the first user only user ID number one which is Ahmed here has only this skill so I will say here PHP and it returns Ahmed let's use small or letter here it still returns this result and both of them also has flutter scale if you notice here so if we search by flutter scale returns both of them right let's use Turkish and only user ID number two has this skill and it turns the second user also now it's a super dynamic by the way even if we search inside the skills dot field dot name thanks to this method it make it easy you can watch this video about it for using where relation instead of where has right so now let's see the result I will comment it to show you here die and dump relation and column here for explaining this part now refresh if you notice here it's search inside scales dot field the relationship which means the relationship called field inside scales here inside scale model and it has also name column this one and it will search for users who has skills with this name field 
so I will say here return users who has skills in programming field for example programming or remove the undump now refresh both of them has programming skills let's add a new field here right and I will add here cooking or yeah cooking foods refresh and I will add it here search by it it must return null right as you can see because no one has skills in cooking food or ID number three has nothing there and even it, do it doesn't match in any of these fields as you can see here right even if we uncomment this line refresh still works correctly right now let's convert this method to trait and make it usable everywhere so here in my app inside traits i will create a new folder here inside app directory called traits slash searchable dot php and here our php file generate space and trait searchable and let's define our method here copy paste right and let's call our query builder here eloquent query query builder this one and also let's call our str from here str or use str illuminate support here let's beautify it quickly and now we must use it inside our models and it will work everywhere because it's very dynamic back in our user and now let's refresh we will face an error search method not defined and now we can say here use searchable trait and refresh now works correctly i will search for ahmad term returns i will search for php works i will search for english both of them have skills in english let's make sure english and english yes it works it's also programming it works perfectly let's test it also for scale model and i will go here for scale model i will say use searchable trait i will index it here and back to my controller i will say here scale model and this is the error what will we face we must provide the searchable array so let's make a small control here so we can say f not this searchable this variable here if not if it's not defined in the model i will throw a message here called new exception or any message you want now let's refresh here please define the searchable property now let's define it inside our scale model so here protected searchable equal to null and let's see what will happen also it must has values so it will search inside the name refresh and it works correctly because we don't have a skill called programming what if we get php now returns a scale which called php what is ai returns ai flutter returns flutter right and here is uh, not a problem we can actually return is to flutter because here we have two flutter skills that find we can actually define it in the mini to mini relationship to avoid duplication and we can make more control and yeah let's also define searching by field dot name for example field dot name so return in in skills relating to programming field so here php ai flutter and flutter as you can see here php field id number one which is programming ai also programming flutter and flutter let's return 
spoken languages and the Turkish, English, and English. Let's find anything here and now return is null, right? And actually, while preparing for this lesson, I wanted to convert this trait to a Laravel package that can be used. So I used ChatGPT that helps me to use or how to create a Laravel package, right? Then I converted this trait to a Laravel package, as you can see here. After that, I published it to packages here my vendor name on github and the package name is fatih laravel search i took the name from fatih sultan muhammad right here and then let's install it to our project laravel project here and let's test it will it work or not so here composer require ahmed sabr slash fatih laravel search enter and it's installed, right? Back to our composer to JSON inside Laravel. And here our package with version one. And here inside our model, user model maybe. Now I am using the original trait and with the searchable fields here. And I will replace it here with our trait package. It's called also searchable right here I need to re-index files and I will say here searchable under my package here this one Ahmad Sabri Fatih Laravel and let's test it here in my controller I am searching using user model back and refresh now the same result I would search maybe for programming field return as users who has skills in programming field let's search for ahmed works also let's use it inside skill model replace it with the package so remove it and searchable using the fatih package and we can search with skill name let's test it with skill drag in we don't have skill called Ahmed, let's say here skills instead of users. And we have a skills called PHP. We have Flutter too, right? As you can see here in our database, we have Turkish and so on. So now we converted this trait to a Laravel package. Here's also, by the way, the GitHub repository if you want to take a look at it. And I will add read me file later if you found it useful support me by clicking on like share and subscribe see you in next videos